Good morning, good people. Good morning, good morning. This your boy. You already know who it is. I don't need to say the name because by now, if you've been watching, you know the name. Uh, a couple of topics I'm going to hit on today. Well, early this morning. First one's going to be safety. Uh, some good friends of mine hit me up last night because they was almost involved into a rear end collision down there in Arkansas. Uh, a driver had fell asleep at the wheel, hit both sides of the guardrail, and then flipped. Uh, a lot of debris everywhere. They shut that highway down for a little minute. Gatewood Park in Arkansas. Uh, nobody was injured, thankfully. You know, there was some shit angels protecting that driver. Uh, driver fell asleep at the wheel, nighttime driver. I don't care what company you with. I don't care. Period. If you feel like you are tired and because you have to get a load, it's better to do a load swap than to sit there and try to take that load. And because you got to get it there, you drive tired. Nighttime is the most dangerous time to be driving or sleep. Put your ass over and call your dispatch and let them know, hey, I'm tired. I'm not going to be able to gonna be a, a couple hours late or I'm gonna be 30 minutes late, whatever the case may be. Because really it's 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 a lot but too few of us truckers out here, you feel me? This goes from new and old. Uh, everybody wants to make it home to their family. Second topic, control. I see a lot of If you're gonna, if, if you're gonna, if you're gonna be a super trucker and you're gonna do more than what your truck can do, as the speed limit is posted, only truckers will know what I'm talking about. Because there's situations that will make you go faster than what the truck is supposed to go. Look here, uh, let's talk about this for a minute. Uh, Y'all can call me crazy. I don't know fuck what y'all say, but I know for a fact this shit works. Everybody wants to drive with like this and shit. And y'all be loose. So whenever the uh, truck gets to swaying and shit, y'all lose control. Okay. That's pretty much how it goes. Because you guys drive comfortable. Now, there's a give and take with that. Drive comfortable at your own. I don't know if I said that right. Y'all know what I mean. Drive comfortable at your speed. But if you're going to be this super trucker and you, you're trying to do whatever the hell you're trying to do, let me tell you guys something. Know how to control. The truck don't drive you. You drive the truck. going to let the truck drive you, you need to stop right there. You driving, hit the tight curb and it's windy. Don't, don't get a tight grip. God damn it, if you got to flex your goddamn arms, you see that, you see that, Look, you got to flex, you flex that motherfucker, but be able to control it. Because as long as you got that tight grip and you got them, you got that flex in there, this truck will stay with you, believe me. Trust me, your truck will stay with you. Flex tight grip but stay loose half keep that range of motion because if you lose you're gonna be all over the place you gotta you gotta muscle i ain't gonna lie you gotta muscle this damn motherfucker especially if you if you if you if you heavy you have to muscle you gotta muscle it don't let the truck drive you you drive the truck you gotta drive the truck you can't sit there and let the truck drive you it would get you out of a lot of good, that harsh situations. And I ain't gonna lie, I got me going through the mountains. And the motherfuckers just windy like that. Yeah, you, uh, mm -hmm. you gotta flex, man. You gotta muscle through it. You gotta hug. You gotta put the guns to work. You gotta put them to work. Uh, next safety topic. Always get out looks. A lot of us don't do it. But if you ain't a tight squeeze, you know what I'm saying? Get out, look, man. You got to. Man, I'm getting big. God damn. Y'all, 
I need to start working out. Y'all got any suggestions? I'm gonna get a jump rope and uh, jump rope that shit out, man. Work on my cardio. I gotta get this weight off. It's the biggest I have been. Shit, Get that truck driving away. Um, back to what I was saying. So get out. Look, who cares? Hell, even the rest of us get out. Look, 38 goddamn times. So what? If you gotta get out more than four times. Hell, three times. Who cares? Drivers, if you're team driving, keep that communication. You know, if you have to, use a cell phone to communicate the uh, distance and whatnot. That way, you guys know, like, okay, uh, you know, if the person say, "Come on back, we get here," instead of them trying to yell, fucking seventy-two, three feet up ahead. Because honestly, man, can't nobody hear that shit. Can't nobody hear that shit. Can't nobody hear none of that shit. None of that. Uh, oh yeah, happy new year's to everybody, you know what I'm saying, uh, hopefully great things come in 2020, and I will, I'll probably post tomorrow, I don't know, uh, yeah, cause I got, I'll keep the videos coming though, like I said, if you guys, I hate that shit, if you guys, uh, like what y'all hear, or whatever, like, subscribe, share, Boy, you already know who it is. Signing out.